The view high above our broadcast location tonight. Bogic is out there with Robinson. And it's Autobio in at the five spot. And for the Lakers, LeBron and Davis, the incredible forward pair. Contavious Caldwell Pope is out there with Dennis Schroeder. And Harrell's in at the center. Bogic against Schroeder. Pass to Autobio. Butler. Oh, and the jam by Butler. And there is some intelligence behind the passing of Adebayo. Not flashy, but making smart ones. And, Bones, when you look at Jimmy Butler's elite impact at both ends, you could argue he's the best two-way shooting guard in the NBA. Clay Thompson might have something to say about that, G.A., but certainly Jimmy Butler and his physical presence allows him to play a multitude of positions. So sliding down to the three and getting physical is something that Jimmy will do. We know that he'll take on any assignment and compete with it. And Caldwell Pope drops them both. Yeah, much improved foul shooter. KCP also starting to get to the line at a higher rate. Pass to Butler. The kick out to Dragic. Passes it to Robinson. Six to shoot. Here's Butler. It's rebounded by Schroeder. Well, Mid-range is where he makes the money. So when the D's slow to get out on him, always surprising to see him miss from there. And Caldwell Pope has improved as a passer. Nice to see that development in his game. A little over a minute gone here in the first quarter. Here's Autobio, and it's in after a nice bounce off the right side. Now, what a great option he gives them on every possession. Down low, and Davis with the basket on the assist by Schroeder. A heady play there from Schroeder, zipping the pass to the teammate who had the cleanest look on the possession. Outside Dragic. The pass to Olenek. And he could not get that one to go. Out of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. This is his first free throw of the game. The first free throw is good. Now, Kelly Olenek coming into the league as the league has shifted to the pace and space play. And Kelly more than capable as a five-man of drilling the outside shot. Yep, that one goes. Uncovered at the rim, finding cracks in the defense here early on. Just really smart basketball and exploiting whatever holes that he's seeing right now in the defensive squad. Now here's Butler. The kick out to Dragic. And again, it's the Heat missing. I know it's about defending the post and the three-point line these days, but still got to be active in the mid-range area and the defense gets away with one there. Now their offense is rolling. A perfect start. Four of four so far. Outside Robinson. With some arc. And Davis sends it back. Phenomenal defense by Anthony Davis to spike that shot back. Make a heck of a volleyball player. That's a perfect lob leading to a spectacular dunk from Davis there. Threw it up on time, on target. And here's Dragic. He'll bring it up for the Miami Heat. Six-point game. Butler passes to Dragic. Here is Davis. Guy is a potent offense right now. You know what, guys? And they're playing with a certain amount of assuredness in their game. That type of confidence is what leads teams to having success. Not really his best quarter as far as scoring. Let's see if he can eventually get back on track. And James gets it to go. And I've said this. You can... You can coach a lot of different ways. You can win a lot of different ways. But you've got to be sincere and true to your principles and, and your philosophy. And those are the coaches, and I've had them that have done it different ways, but they've been the most successful. And listen, you've also, at the professional level, you've got to have a presence about you. You've got to have some charisma out there as well to get these men to buy in. Here's Caruso following the score by Avery Bradley. Gasol kicks to Caruso. The kick out to Matthews. Here's Davis. Miami grabs the miss. Three on three. Here's Hero. And he gets the whistle. Two. That rookie season. 
And I think this is very much the type of player that comes in. Checked in for Los Angeles. Contavious Caldwell Pope comes in for Wesley Matthews. And Miami also making a switch. Andre Gudala. He's checked in for Jimmy Butler. Poked away. It's stolen by Bradley. For the finish. Throws down the breakaway jam. That's instinctual play by Avery Bradley. The coaching staff loves to see him go after those kind of steals. And the Lakers with another turnover here. For those shooters, you're going to be there all night long. For Miami, they've gone four for nine from the field to start this game off. Iguodala deciding where to go with it. Connects from three-point range. Well, Iguodala setting up, getting that good, strong base. He becomes a much better shooter when he does that. Kuzma outside. Back to LeBron. And he drops it in from the low post. James has got six. Well, he's knocking down most everything, guys. Three of four here. Kuzma against Iguodala. Doesn't go that time. Caldwell Pope with some nice D. On up the court. Here's Davis. Great D that time from Adebayo. For Miami, they've gone just a shade under 50% from the field. Five of 11. And here's the fast break. Davis leading the way. A shot by Caldwell Pope. No good. They can trade two for one here. Would be the right move, I believe, right now. Here's Hero. No good on the triple. Rare you'll see him miss such an open look. And Kuzma gets it to go on the assist by Davis. Anthony Davis showing those young AD skills as a point guard. One second separating the shot clock and game clock. Here's Autobio. And the rejection by LeBron. Fast break. The Lakers. The lead pass was put in just the right spot. He's got six. Even though Davis gets bodied just a little bit, he still knocks down the shot right in the defense's face. From D, Big Udawa. No good there. Offense, the order of the day as the first quarter comes to a close. Well, the coaches preach ball movement, and we saw exactly why in that first quarter. Well, everybody just feeling the energy of the basketball as they moved it around, and lots of hands were touching it. On the court for Miami here in the second. In the middle, it's Olenek in Adebayo. Kendrick Nunn out there with Hero. And it's Iguodala in at the three spot. And the strides to adjust, but Kuz doesn't back off. Trogic has checked in. Both good from the line that time. Greg, I think of you in a New York Knicks uniform, legendary arena you played in. What was that experience like? Kevin, intense. I, I remember <laughs> the first time I suited up in a preseason game, we played the Dallas Mavericks. Both teams went up and down the court three times, and nobody scored, and the fans started booing. And that's when I knew this is a little bit different. Uh, you better bring your A game. And thicker skin, correct? That, too. Yeah. <laughs> Fortunately, there was no social media or Internet back then. Goodness gracious. <laughs> Jimmy Butler, he's checked in for the Heat. Robinson comes in for Andre Iguodala. Oh, size and reach and timing. That's all Montrez Harrell there throwing that one out. Took him no time at all on that one. All well, Pope's got the lead up to 10 now for Los Angeles. And it's Dragic with the ball for Miami. Pass to none. Here in the second quarter with a little over a minute gone. Lakers leading by 10. And here is James. He has six. Kuzma passes to LeBron. Doesn't go for him. Great D that time from Adebayo. They need a good offensive possession. Yeah, they've gone a long time without a bucket. Dragic with a wide open look. Offensive rebound heat. Adebayo on the follow. Physical. He's a presence down there. Anthony Davis has checked in for Kyle Kuzma. Schroeder against Dragic. Here's James. And the layup's good off the glass. 
LeBron's got eight. And they're forcing the ball inside, and it's working like a charm. And Brent Story has it in his draft workouts. The Heat ran out of bio to exhaustion, then put him to the test carding wing players. Yeah, they looked at him and said, in effect, you must not know who I am and the kind of work that I've done. He's got that kind of edge, and that's the thing that this Heat culture is always looking for. Schroeder dishes to LeBron. Rejected by Dragic, and they're able to recover. Schroeder looking over the floor. Moves back up. Four on the shot clock. Here's Harold. That one off the back iron and out. The Heat trail by seven. That's a two from Butler. Anthony Davis grabs the miss. And this feels like it's snowballed a little bit on them. The more he tries to shoot his way out of this slump, the worse it seems to get. They need him to get it together. And this is why coaches talk about playing with pace. The scoreboard tells it all. Kind of get a team defensively on their heels, and if you can keep pushing and keep attacking, they'd never find some kind of defensive balance to help slow you down. Outside for Caldwell Pope. Pass to LeBron. That's in there. Davis with the assist. LeBron's got four this quarter. Yeah, hard to stop LeBron from getting in that deep. So the size, the speed, the power, the position. Two more. Another rebound hauled in. They're hitting the glass with a lot of passion. A reverse. The shot will not fall. And the Heat going the other way now. To the left side wing. None wide open. Again, the Heat good for two. Well, that's the kind of passing right there that makes a difference. Not just in that possession, but maybe on your play for the entire game. Passes to Davis. And it's good for two. Davis has got eight points. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now especially on the interior. Timeout called the Heat. Played here, and they have to get recharged. That's a great point. Without proper hydration, a player can completely run out of gas down the stretch of a, of a game. And that's something that none of these guys can afford to have happen. If you're going to battle all the way to the finish, you have got to be hydrated. Looking at who's out there now for the Lakers. Marcus Gasol has checked in for LeBron. Matthews comes in for Harrell. Alex Caruso, he's checked in for Contavious Caldwell Pope. And Alfonso McKinney is subbed in for Dennis Schroeder. Outside Matthews. Gasol kicks to Matthews. Butler against Davis. That's another one for him. His fifth in just seven shots. That's the 10th straight point they've given up in the paint. The Heat trail by seven. To the middle. Here's Butler. And Davis sends it back. And he gets it back. The Lakers have gone six of ten from the floor here in the second quarter. 40 seconds left now here in the second. Deflects the pass. Gasol passes to Matthews. Here's Davis, and the Lakers check on two more. Now Davis attacking right now inside. Big man playing big and giving this offense maybe a little bit more of an edge on the inside. Gasol with the steal. Pull up Jay, and it's Davis with the jam. And unfortunately, we've seen a few too many of those. A lack of concentration, a turnover, and an easy bucket in transition. Davis against Butler. And he makes that one. The defenders are trying to keep pace with Jimmy Butler, but there's enough space for him to spot the rim and knock it down. Anthony Davis firing on all cylinders for Los Angeles. He had 14 points. One half to go. You look at Anthony Davis in this game. He's been everywhere. 
Yeah, he's been nothing short of a wall at the rim so far in this one, single-handedly providing great rim protection. Been aggressive to block shots, but also avoiding fouls. That's a, that's a heavy presence inside. Contavious Caldwell Pope is out there with Anthony Davis. Then it's Montrez Harrell. Then there's Dennis Schroeder. And it's Caruso in at the shooting guard position. That's the group starting the second half for Frank Vogel. They've all four of their chances so far in this one. And the fine skill set that belies his nickname. Over five assists per game. He's a creator, not just a finisher. And the Heat have given Adebayo the leeway to rip and run, baby. Make things happen. And Kevin, an unselfish player who loves to pass. Even back in high school, playing with lesser talent, he made sure to find the others. The assist totals, Kevin, just continue to grow. They're way ahead in that category. Ball movement has been flawless. There's the pass to Adebayo. Back to Dragic. And Davis sends it back. And they've only got a slight edge on the boards, but it just feels a lot bigger. And good that time. They're scoring boatloads of buckets. It's raining buckets from inside. Up top, Dragic. He's guarded by Schroeder. 13 feet away. And it's good off the back of the rim and in. Dragic has got five points so far. And Dragic is a solid shooter, especially from the mid-range area on the floor. Schroeder finds Harrell. Out to the right wing. Trying to get open is Davis. Caruso, no good. And here's Dragic. He'll bring it up for the Heat. Trailing by 10. From outside the arc, the Lakers with the rebound. That's one for their first four to start the second half. Here's Schroeder. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. That one on Olenek. Greg, you were drafted 12th overall by the New York Knicks and then second overall by the Grizzlies in the expansion. So you've had a very unique view of being in that position in two different settings. Yeah, I mean, two very different cities, but really each beautiful in its own way. Uh, the, the New York draft, obviously coming out of college, that was like a dream come true to go and play for Pat Riley and, and then get the opportunity to go and be a part of a brand new team in a new country, if you will, was also uh, a, a really cool experience as well. I hope we can take a petition started by you and me to get the NBA back in Vancouver. I miss and going Seattle, to Vancouver. Seattle, right? Let's get back oh, in and both Seattle. those cities. Exactly. exactly. Team starts the second half missing four of five shots. When does the coach possibly call a timeout and reiterate what he talked about at halftime? Knocks it loose. A touch over two and a half minutes of basketball played here in the third quarter. Tyler Hero, he's checked in for Miami. We have got to see that sensational mobile one block again. Determined to protect the lead with the all-out effort defensively. Superb anticipation on the block. Andre Igudawa has checked in for Goran Dragic. Harrell with it. Now defended by Adebayo. Schroeder outside, inside, Davis. Just excellent recognition by Anthony Davis to sell the shot fake. Gets the defense up in the air. Lakers shooting their seventh and eighth free throw attempts for the game right here. Definitely an area where they can improve. Only 73% as a team from the line last year. And both free throws good for Davis. And it's been a really good day for him at the line. Some other bigs have well-documented problems on their free throws. He's not one of them. Here's Autobio. And they call the foul, so a chance at the line for one more coming up. And every bit of the body control right there for Adebayo out there going right through the contact. This is his third free throw attempt of the game. Los Angeles leading by 13. James looking around. Cross contact on the shot, and now a three-point play chance as he'll head to the line. The ball movement on this run has been fantastic and is a big part of why they've been able to get 
these good looks. The Lakers have been at their finest four at the free throw line tonight. Eight attempts, eight makes. Impeccable from the line since halftime. Butler on the way over Davis. And it's Butler missing. Just a solid performance on the interior. The rebounding has been off the chart. That shot by Caldwell Pope, no good. The Heat trail by 16. Iguodala with it. He's picked up by James. Out to the wing. Shot's good by Hero. Hero's got five points so far. And you can tell Tyler Hero has put some hours in shooting the rock. Here's Caldwell Pope. And Adebayo sends it back. Here's Butler. Iguodala. And staying with the play, Iguodala. A little bit. Call time to just let them get their legs right, back under them. And Los Angeles with some changes. Marcus Gasol has checked in for Harold. Kyle Kuzma comes in for Anthony Davis. And Wesley Matthews subbed in for Dennis Schroeder. Bradley's checked in for the Heat. That shot by Caldwell Pope, no good. And his shooting has been a little bit below par. You think about what this lead would look like if he was on. 144 and left to play here in the third. Iguodala with the steal. It's Bradley on the wing. Seven points in the game. Count the basket. The adjustments they've made offensively, they're putting guys in a position now to succeed. Yeah, possessions is way more efficient, I think, here tonight. Taking smarter, better shots, moving the ball around. That's helped them to get back in the ball game. Outside Matthews. Pass to Kuzma. Lock at six. The kick out to Matthews. Let's the three fly. Jimmy Butler with the rebound. And it's Miami's ball. They're on a 12 to 3 run right now. And Adebayo throws it down. Smart play by Jimmy Butler. Spots the open man. And have a chit chat with the team to settle down. And the Lakers with some changes. Montrez Harrell, he's checked in for Gasol. And Dennis Schroeder subbed in for Matthews. And Miami also making a switch. Olenek's checked in. Here's Schroeder on the pass to Kuzma. The shot's good on the assist by Schroeder. Schroeder's got his fourth assist in this one. And it's Bradley with the ball for Miami. Seven-point differential. To the inside. Adebayo kicks to Iguodala. And stolen by James. Two-second difference between shot clock and game clock. Oh, a nice defensive play to disrupt the alley-oop. And really the smart thing would be to hold for the last shot. Yeah, every second right now is valuable to you. That should be their strategy. Igudawa, wide open. And the three off target. Ahead, and so it's Los Angeles. Bringing the quarter to a close with a seven-point lead. Their lead is where it is because... The fourth quarter has arrived. So good to have you with us. Here's Dragic. And for Miami, look at who they've got out there. In the middle, it's Olenek in Adebayo. Bradley is out there with Dragic. And it's Robinson in at the three. That one's in there. The Lakers' lead is cut down to five on the bucket from Dragic. Here's James, pass to Kuzma, shoots over Olenek, and Kuzma gets it to go on the assist by LeBron. A great assist there from LeBron, going to try to set the table all night. The Heat trail by seven. Outside Bradley. Robinson with it. Back to Bradley. Just five to shoot. And it's LeBron James with the rebound. James has got his sixth rebound on the night. Solid rebound there. And with the score like it is, that's an area where they can't afford to get lazy. Schroeder against Adebayo. And that one's good. Schroeder 
Now, don't want to body him up. He's just too fast as Schroeder's able to get it done. Miami's gone 5 of 9 when they put up the three point shot tonight. Timeout called the Heat. And Coach can't be happy, and, and I think I know why. Their defense putting up no resistance inside. No, they're not preventing them from scoring. And if you can get to a high efficiency shot on the floor, and that's the paint, you just keep going. And Anthony Davis is checked in for the Lakers. And Miami also making a switch. Nunn's checked in. He gets a chance now to catch up with the fourth member of our crew, Hall of Famer David Aldridge. Thanks, guys. I was able to hear Eric Spolster coaching the team during the break. He said, this is where we make our move. This game's going to come down to big plays. Whichever team makes them is going to come out of here with the win. Kevin, we know what side he's on. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. Outstanding job by AD to get close to the basket, get the ball in great position, and force the defense to resort to fouling him. And both free throws good for Davis. And what an advantage. You really feel like you can always trust him when he's at the line. Now Drogic and Dennis Schroeder gets the whistle that time. And that'll be his third foul so far. Here's Drogic. Pass to none. Now Olenek. From down in the low post, it goes. Well, Kelly Olenek can score all over, but really valuable when you start to get points from this kind of balanced attack. Robinson against LeBron. And the basket is good, and he's got a chance here for one more at the line. Almost an impossible shot to block in the post. The defender can't give up that much of a height advantage and expect to contest it. Caldwell Pope, he's checked in for Alex Caruso. And Miami also making a switch. Butler, he's checked in for Kendrick Nunn. Well, every night, the competitive killer instinct of LeBron James makes him as elite as he's been. Of course, a future first ballot Hall of Famer and a lot of gas, it seems, left in the tank for LeBron James. Rogic dishes to Robinson. He kicks to Butler. Olenek has the open look. The shot's good on the assist by Butler. Olenek showing some confidence now, and the big man is catching and firing. Outside, Davis, and they double up Davis. It's stolen by Adebayo. Here's Butler. Uses the glass to finish the layup. And all of a sudden, we've got a ball game, guys. No, no doubt about it. I'm sensing a major momentum swing here after that steal and run out. Olenek with the steal. Robinson with it. He's picked up by James. The pass to Dragic. And it's Contavious Caldwell Pope with the foul. That's his first foul. Well, if you're just tuning in, welcome. We've got about three and a half minutes gone here in the fourth quarter. And there's the call. It's going to be an illegal screen. And he's done a good job of keeping control of the ball. Even with that turnover, you can tell his teammates trust him to hang on to the pill. The Heat making a switch here. Heroes checked in. Caldwell Pope on the wing. Lakers working the ball around now. Pass to Schroeder. Back to James. And LeBron throws it down. LeBron showing all the ways that he can dominate a game here on another level in this one. And so it's Butler with it. He'll bring it up for the Miami Heat. They trail by nine points. And the rejection by James. Davis the pass to James. And the dunk by LeBron. LeBron James, here's the report, Kevin. Still athletic. The Heat trail by 11. Outside Butler. One forty-four left in the fourth quarter of this one. And Davis sends it back. And the dunk by James. 
beautiful transition offense there. That's execution at its best. Yeah, once you burst through a seam like that, you got to look right towards the rim. Sweet play. And the Heat call time here. And now, let's present our New Balance player of the game, LeBron James. He's put on a shooting exhibition for us here tonight. He's missed a couple along the way, but it sure seems like everything's been falling for him. The only way to keep him from converting is to keep the ball out of his hand. The better he played, the more these fans got revved up. And that continued to play out over the course of his amazing performance. And that one falls for Anthony Davis. Well, as good as AD already is, to think that there's still upside to his game. It's, it's really remarkable. Athletic, talented, and continues to work hard to maximize his talent. The Heat trail by 15. And tonight's battle is going to end with a very clear winner, leaving nothing to chance. Impressive win for the Lakers. Well, the one thing that jumps out in this game is the free throw shooting which they did a much better job at. Absolutely. A, a big plus. And oftentimes your performance at the line can be the difference in a game. And I think tonight we saw that. And we watched one guy all night long, guys. And, and look at the stats. Just confirms what a dominant game he had. What a night tonight it was for LeBron. Just knows how to fill it up. And that's exactly what he did tonight. Nobody that they assigned to him could really get a handle on him. Look, it's always great to get into a rhythm, but do it when it matters. Yeah, it's tough to mount a comeback like this and then fall oh so short. I'm sure that's weighing on them just a little bit. Now, here's Butler. We've got 28 seconds left here in the fourth quarter. They shoot again. He lays it in. Butler with the ball up in the air just sniffs that one out and he goes in and rips it down. And the Lakers can just let the clock run down here. Here's LeBron. Count that one. And the Lakers lead by 13. Finishing strong. This is how you want to close things out. Yeah, definitely putting a stamp on this one. A very, very decisive victory for the club tonight. Here's Hero. And there's the foul on the shot. He'll go to the line for two. And the foul called on Los Angeles. Hero right now working himself into a lather, staying aggressive and drawing the defense's attention. Here's Morris. And so it's the Lakers taking care of business here. Some good competition, but the hometown advantage and their ability to stay focused, I think, made the difference. Yeah, and the, the first step in becoming a good team is your ability to win at home.